Hey everybody, welcome back. Um, I am very excited to get to meet with another one of our World of Warship influencers. This is the Bad News Baron. So say hello. 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 How's it going? Going good, how are you? Great, great. So is this your first PAX? Uh, no, this is my, with my first PAX Prime, but I went PAX South, PAX East, and now I'm here. So that's a lot I'm very of PAX. Excited. Yeah, a lot right of PAX. On. So Bad News Baron, that's kind of a unique name. How did you fall into that one? Uh, because I don't like being the Baron of Bad News. So it's a little pun, and then we had to shorten it. So I like it. There you go. So uh, how did you how did you get your start? You're a streamer, obviously the Twitch regalia. You uh, yeah. How did you get started? Um, all right. So I started streaming um, because I was, I was watching a lot of streamers playing this game Star Citizen, and, and I was like, I could do this. I I can I can do this really well. So I started, and uh, and it, it wasn't that difficult. The challenge isn't starting streamer because there's 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 millions of people who are streaming, right? Who start streaming. And then they find out that the real challenge is, is creating engaging content and trying to keep it fresh and interesting for your audiences. And, and then the fun begins. Right. So creating the engaging content, keeping people interested, growing, like yeah. what, are your, what are your plans? How do you do that? Um, <laughs> so It's an easy question. It's still in its infancy, I think. Um, streaming is one of those things where it's been around for only a, only a few years. And with the technology that we have, there's so many ways that we can push this further and further. Like uh, Old Spice did live streaming, <laughs> like Twitch plays a person in the woods. Yeah, there's there's all sorts of things you can, you can do. So it's it's a, producing a show, and then making that show as interesting as possible and as interactive as possible for the audience. Right on. So World of Warships seems to be something you you do a lot oh, of. Yeah. Yeah. How did you how did you find that? You know how long have you been doing that? Um, I've been doing that for a few months. Well, actually, since it, since. The day the open beta dropped, yep, yep. I started doing it. Um, I'm primarily a space game streamer. Like my my old channel is based in that genre. Well, there's a but, new space game coming out. Yeah. Yes, Ma Master looks amazing, incredible. It looks awesome. But there was a there was a lull in content, so I went looking around for what else I could do. And ships, not in not in space, but on a planet in space. <laughs> and I love naval stuff. I love naval games, so this fit with me, and my audience loved it as well. And so it's it's become a passion. So what? I mean, as far as the ships go, what do you? What's your uh, what's carrier? Your style? Your carrier? Carrier all the way. Like it, it becomes an RTS at, at that point. And people tell me that I play it completely wrong and backwards, but I have so much fun with it. It's yeah, a, dude, it's a, it's good. Are, they're hard. I'm terrible at pretty much everything. I I uh, I try destroyers, no good. I have to go with the sort of punch your own weight. So I go with the battleships. You know, sit yeah. back and take shots. So. Doing stream, you know, doing warships on the stream. What, if you can think about it, most memorable battle that you've had, you know, maybe a challenging situation, or the most fun you had doing ships. All right. So the thing that I remember I was doing World of Warships um, was not in a carrier. Actually, it was I was I was a battleship. There was a giant torpedo drop coming towards me, and that's like <laughs> death when you're a battleship. Yeah. Other battleship on on my team coming the other end. We and we're gonna ram each other because yeah. these torpedoes are coming. End up hitting each other pushing each other in such a way that we sort of do this and the torpedoes completely move past Just us. Just like you drew it Completely up, yeah. accidental teamwork because we weren't paying attention. That's one of those things you can like never do again. Yeah, no, it was, it was beautiful. So, I mean, I guess it, we don't have a whole ton of time, but, but yeah. in, in closing, you, uh, like you said, you love doing this. You've been doing it for a while. Yeah. There are a lot of people, as you brought up, that do try to get into this niche streaming and doing videos online. I mean, yep. what, what advice do you have to somebody who's new Who's at home that's watching right now going, how does he do it? Like, what do so you So find a way to make yourself different <laughs> is, is what I would say. Because you cannot just jump on the stream and start playing a game and start staring and expect people to come and watch. You have to actually talk to them. Never stop talking. Pretend you're a sportscaster or, or something like that. Just make it, make it your own. Find something unique and roll with it. Awesome. Well, Bad News Baron, thank you so much for, uh, for joining us. I really appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of PAX. Thank, Thank you. you and I much. think we've got... Uh, oh. And you can follow oh. me on the twitch.tv slash Bad News Baron on Twitter at The Bad News Baron. Say it again one more time. Um, Twitter, The Bad News Baron. On Twitch, just slash Bad News Baron. And then Bad News Baron.com. Just go do it. Bad News Baron. Thanks again, man. Thank Appreciate you. it. Thank awesome. you very much. Thanks.